What's up guys, I'm back and today I'm going to show you how you can get better battery life on iOS 12. Now iOS 12 has great performance but battery life can still be troublesome. So follow these steps to get better battery life. Now we all know that iOS 12 does not allow us to switch off Wi-Fi and Bluetooth from the control center. So make sure when you're not using them, you turn them off manually inside of settings. They can seem a bit of juice in the background and you don't want that. Now after that, go to general accessibility and click on reduce transparency. Make sure it is enabled. It'll just reduce the blur all around. Now scroll down and click on reduce motion and enable it too. Now essentially it'll just reduce the parallax effect and all the animations will be now faded instead of being bouncy. Now go back and click on background app refresh and turn it off. Now essentially what background app refresh does is it keeps on refreshing the applications in the background in the app switcher. So when you're not using Facebook, it'll just keep updating your feed and all that stuff. So it'll just keep the application updated and all that stuff and it consumes a lot of battery so make sure that is turned off now after that just go back go to the main page of the menu section and in there click on Siri now if you have an iPhone 6s or older you'll have an option for hey Siri and make sure that is turned off if you don't want it anyways because it keeps Siri alert and that consumes a lot of data and battery so make sure hey Siri is turned off if you never use it now iPads in general have great battery and standby time but if you want more of it just go to settings general and click on multitasking and dock and inside that turn off suggested application. Now on the dock there is this extra section which just shows your last use application and the application it suggests you. Make sure that is turned off if you don't want it and don't use it. It consumes a little bit of data and you can actually follow the same steps on the iPad too. Just go to accessibility, inside of there go to reduce motion, turn that off, go back, you can just turn off reduce transparency too and that's that. So you can just follow all the steps on the iPad that you just did on the iPhone including background app refresh. Now another feature I want to talk about is called screen time. Now iOS 12 has a feature called screen time. I guess everyone knows that and it allows you to restrict you from using a particular application to enhance battery life and you can actually see your battery status inside of screen time so that's pretty nifty. And if you turn on airplane mode when your phone is at low battery you can actually get a lot of battery with that too. Also when you're charging your phone and not using your data services and all that stuff you can turn on airplane mode. It'll just charge your phone faster than usual. So keep these tips in mind. You also have low power mode. That's a pretty good feature, I guess. But hope you guys enjoyed the video. More content coming soon. Until then, please like, comment, and subscribe. Peace.